these are humongous. These are the vultures? Condors. What are they called? Condors. They're like the vultures of Africa, right? So this is like the outside exhibit. Look at this guy. He's huge. Look how cute he is. Hello, little dude. Hmm. walk the street. I kind of just want to come back with Anthony for the weekend just to walk the streets. <laughs> I know that sounds weird but I just want to do that. It just feels awesome just to walk the street. This weekend was so good for my soul. I'm so glad that my sister invited me for the weekend. We had so much fun. We had so many laughs. We did so many cool things um, and I'm just so uh, grateful that I got this opportunity to go this weekend and experience so many new things and a town that I kind of want to keep on coming back to. Um, so that's pretty cool. So we are leaving to go home now. It's like an hour and a half, two hour drive. And, um, yeah. Until we meet again. It's really chilly. So I'm attempting to feed this chipmunk by hand. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I really want to experience this in my life. So I got a chip. Let's see, hi Chippy. Here, come here. Here we go. Oh my God, he's coming. Come on, come on, come on. Oh. Hi, come on. Hello. It's okay. Oh, here. Come on. Oh, there we go. Oh, come on. It's okay. I will not hurt you. I will be your friend. Hey, come on. Over here. Come on. I got snacks. Come on. You should come here. Who should come here? Oh, okay, clean yourself, all right. All right, come on. Come on. Oh, he gets so close. Oh, here, oh, I think I started something. I think I really started something. I'm surrounded by them, I'm surrounded. Okay, here we go. Okay, oh, okay, okay. Here we go. I got snacks. Come on. Come on, little guy. Here we go. Oh, okay. All right. He's not. Come on. Oh, she's so cute. Come on. Where did he go? Oh, okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come see me. Oh, wow. Well, there we go. Okay. You don't want. Okay. Goodbye.
today is Monday, November 16th, and today I'm going back to work, and I just wanted to like recap the weekend. It was so much fun. I went on my very first Uber ride, which uh, the first two were awesome. Um, the third one was not so awesome. Um, I thought we were gonna die. Um, it was very crazy, uh, flying, uh, around turns that clearly mar was marked like 22 miles an hour. We're going 90, uh, blowing through yellow lights. And <laughs> then there's one point where there was like, we're in a city, okay, a big city. And then out of nowhere, there are two deer like on the side of the road, like in this little patch of grass. And we're like, uh, where did these deer come from? They're in the middle of a city on a grassy patch. Craziness. Uh, so that was weird. Took my first Uber ride. Good, bad, I guess you'll have that. And then the hotel was so amazing and unique and quirky and I loved every minute of it. So cool. There was a like um, rooftop uh, balcony type thing. It was closed because of COVID, um, but that would have been really neat to see. So I wish we would have got to see that, but that's okay because the rest of the stuff was cool. Um, and then I got to do my very first Turkish dinner cuisine. Um, that was so awesome, guys. It was so awesome. The, the restaurant was all decked out in Turkish culture and artifacts and trinkets. And it was so cool. And the um, chandeliers that came, the fixture, like the light fixtures that came from the ceiling were absolutely gorgeous. And then like all around all the entryways, there was this same pattern of art and it was an eye. And so I asked about like what this eye was because I was like drawn to it. And um, I was like, this is a cool eye. So my sister's best friend, Teresa was on the trip and she has traveled all over um, the world. And she actually lived in Turkey for 15 months. And um, she was telling me about the story with the eye and what it represented and it like wards off evil eye and it, and it has all these mysterious cool um, story behind it and so I asked the owner he was also from Turkey and I asked him like where do I buy these and he's like oh online and but then at the end of the night when we paid our bill and we were getting ready to leave his one friend came in and his one friend makes these keychains with the eye on it and he gave us all one we each got different ones my sister's was so cool it had like the palm um, and then um brianna's had like an it was yellow themed and it had like the owl uh, or the um what is it the elephant and then i got one and Teresa got one and sammy got one and it was so cool and thoughtful of them to do uh so that was pretty cool and then where else? And then we went back to the hotel room, had some glasses of wine and some cucumbers, and we got what we thought was ice cream sandwiches, but it turns out there was no ice cream. It was just real thick icing that gave me the diabetes. So, uh, so that was uh, how we capped off our night. And then the following day, we went to an aviary where we saw all these gorgeous birds so gorgeous. I love them all. There was this one particular one that I loved and I'll insert a picture here. Um, but I was in love with that bird and I was like, I need to have this bird at home, <laughs> but it was fun. Then we got to hand feed squirrels out in a park, which was cool and so awesome. Made my day, literally made my whole day. Um, and then we went to a bakery, which was chaotic, hectic. There was definitely no social distancing there. 
um, wasn't organized very well. It was like a free for, for all and very anxious. Um, so yeah, then we stopped um, for some lunch and then we came home. So it was a very good weekend. Uh, I really enjoyed myself um, and very, very grateful that I had that trip and got to have those memories. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed my weekend vlog and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.